Prince Harry has been seen walking beside his brother Prince William as they follow their grandmother Queen Elizabeth's funeral procession. However, the 38-year-old's experience has had pointedly different moments to his only sibling, who is now heir to the throne. One being that he was unable to perform a salute during key moments, including inside Westminster Hall for the state funeral and while passing the cenotaph. Live updates, world stops to farewell Queen Elizabeth II. The Duke of Sussex was not permitted to make the symbolic gesture as he passed the war memorial because he is no longer a working royal. This is also why the king's brother Prince Andrew was not allowed to, the two men bowing their heads instead. Another more visible difference was that Harry and Andrew were not allowed to wear military uniforms. Instead the pair donned morning suits. Read more, from black hats to brooches, funeral guests wear quiet tributes to the Queen. Read more, a look back on the Queen's visits to Australia. Harry served in the British Army for 10 years and was twice deployed to Afghanistan. He lost his three honorary military titles when he and his wife Meghan Markle stepped down from their senior royal roles in 2020. Prince Andrew served in the Falklands War in 1982 during his 22 years in the Royal Navy. He was stripped of his military titles and royal patronages in January after facing a U.S. civil action over sexual assault allegations. King Charles III, Princess Anne, Prince Edward and Prince William wore military uniforms, 